Hey guys, Tuesday afternoon here. How are y'all? I'm doing great. Doing great. Just went to the grocery store, fixing to go home and put together a taco salad for the hubby. He's been working such unbelievably long hours the last few months, but gonna cook. I put up a video a little while ago and I named it Hot Mess Prayer. So, um, if you want to go see my little talk, go do that. And I was going to prove to y'all that I did fix my hair and put on some makeup before I went to the grocery store. <laughs> Might have scared those people to death. Hey, but you know, I am a pretty liberated woman now. And I do. If I don't want to put on any makeup, I don't. So, but I did. I did put on a little bit this afternoon. So, but it is definitely summertime in Alabama. The temperatures, um... I think hit like 92 today and they were supposed to be in the 90s all week so summertime is here that cool weather that we had the other night around july the 4th it is it, not gonna last long and that's very unusual for us too um but anyway uh we had a good july the 4th and uh i had posted a video on that and uh so it's just the rest of the week I've got the boys tomorrow and possibly Thursday. I don't normally keep them two days in a row, um, but it's looking like I may have them two days this week. So, and I mean, they're good. They're really good. It's just that um, I'm older now <laughs> and they wear me out. <laughs> they're so funny. The smallest one, Rhett, he turned two in April. He has the most different personality than his brother. Um, he has a temper. <laughs> we are just, we sit back and get tickled. And I really, I have to get on to him. I really do. I don't spank him because he's hes really, you may disagree with me, but he's really too young to, to understand the consequences of it yet. But um, he bit his brother when I kept him last week and um, he bit him pretty bad. Reed just cried and I got him right up to my feet. My daughter used to hate that. And make him stand toe to toe with me and I told him that we do not bite our brother. Um, and then I made him sit on the couch and time out and I took his um, iPad, the Holy Grail. <laughs> away from him he loves his iPad so but them eyes are so big and brown and dark and he knew he had done something he wasn't supposed to but see ooh, I don't know if I can really spank him for biting I guess I can but I have a confession to make I beat everybody I could find when I was in one of my earlier vlogs when I'm telling about my Aunt Betty uh, that was before she passed away and I did a vlog with her and I, I said Aunt Betty tell them who comes who came to my house and always tried to get me out of the baby bed and and she said I did and the reason that I was in the baby bed is because she had a son that was just a little bit older than me and I would try to bite him <laughs> and I successfully bit a lot of them. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I did, but I did. And this is what's so bad. I can remember biting people. I can remember one little boy that they had, some of y'all won't even know what I'm talking about, but it's called a pot belly stove. It was an old house and they had a, a big wood burning stove in the corner, but it was summertime, so it wasn't even on. Don't even know who these people were, why we were there, anything. But I remember getting him back behind that pot belly stove, and I remember biting him. So, my mother said when I was about four, we were at a family reunion, uh, probably about an hour away from our home, and she said, this little boy bit me. And she said his mother and relatives were just traumatized. They could not believe he bit me. And mother said it was still kind of cool. And she said I had a little sweater on over a little dress. So I had double layers of sleeves that he bit me on. And mother said you would have thought the world was coming to an end. <laughs> She said I wailed and hollered and cried and said those people were so embarrassed because their son had bit me. And my mother was like, no, 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 no. 
do not be upset. She needs somebody to bite her. It's not nice, is it? <laughs> but mother said she knew the only way that I was ever going to get broken from biting people was for someone to bite me. And so she said, I think she said I got bit twice and quit. So, and I was about, I guess I was about four because I was not as young as Rhett because I distinctly remember biting people. <laughs> and I don't know why, I guess it was a little vampire in there or something. <laughs> but anyway, so Mr. Rhett may be like his grandmother. <laughs> I may have to turn around and bite him back one day, but that'd be hard because he's so daggum pretty. <laughs> so sweet. But he's got a temper. Reed is much more laid back. And Reed talks non-stop. And when I, on the days that I keep him, he sits. When I sit, he is sitting under me. And my daughter, Ashley, says he does that to her all the time. And she says, I always have to say, I've got to remember that there will come a time, I'm passing a lot of traffic on a curvy road here. I've got to remember that there will come a time when he does not want to sit next to me. So I've got to enjoy this time and, and cherish it. And I said, that's true, that's true. So, but if I move from the couch to the recliner, he moves from the couch to the recliner. If I move from the recliner to the couch, he moves. So I've just done it before just to watch him to see what he'll do. And he sits completely up under me, but he's much more laid back, but he's my little chatty Kathy. Uh, he, he talks, but his mother was that way too. So for some reason, there seems to be a lot of traffic on this little road I'm trying to get home. And so I'm fixing to go in here and fix us up some taco salads tonight. Sounded pretty good. Um, trying to get in touch with my husband all evening to ask him what he wanted to eat. And he um, is head of the IT department at the college. And he has some tremendously long service calls sometimes that he's on with different companies. So he has not answered me. So I have no idea if taco salads sound good to him, but guess what? He's getting taco salads this afternoon. <laughs> so, but anyway, um, I just wanted to come back on here and tell y'all it's been a great day. It's been um, um, just a, a pretty day. It's been hot, but um, just enjoyed today. And um, hope you've had a good day. I'm going to be doing more daily vlogs just to keep in touch with everybody and see what's going on. I really look forward to your vlogs and enjoy watching and seeing what other people do with their with their days and, and what all they do. Um, it's, it's, it's interesting to me. Uh, my husband says that I love watching them so much because I'm so nosy. But I, I tell him I am not nosy. I am curious. <laughs> So, I hope y'all have had a good day. I'm fixing to pull into the garage. It's going to get dark here. So, hope y'all have had a good day, and I'll be checking back in with you later. Bye.